Elise saint rain is a commune in the Côte d'Or department in the Burgundy region of eastern France. The inhabitants of the commune are known as Alisians or Alisian. Geography Elise saint rain is located some 17 km southeast of Montbard and 50 km northwest of Dijon. The D905 from Venere les Lambs to Posanges in the south passes through the western part of the commune. Access to the village however is on the D103, D103J, and D103T from Venerage les Lambs in the west which continues east to join the D10 road. Apart from the village, the commune consists of farmland with some forest and a horse racing track in the west. The Ozerain River forms most of the southern border of the commune and flows west to join the Brenner west of the commune. Neighboring communes and villages etymology Because of its identification with Elysia the origin of the name of Elise saint Rain has been the subject of numerous studies. Several ideas have been proposed for a root of Asterisk Alice and three proposals have attracted the attention of linguists and toponymists. Alisia, Rocky Height, Cliff, Source. These points were confirmed by Jacques Lacroix in his study of the God of Elise. Alisanos. Research on Alisia remains largely unfinished despite numerous attempts to develop the subject. The theme of the Oronima asterisk Alis or asterisk Ales meaning rocky height is the one that is currently most frequently put forward to explain the name of Elysia. It is from an Indo-European root asterisk palace or asterisk pales. The initial P became silent in Celtic. While on the contrary it remains in Latin place names such as Palatinus for example. In Germanic the Indo-European P was mute F which gives asterisk Felisa in Lower Old Frankish. Felisa in Old High German or the German Fels meaning rock. A number of researchers also believe that the term may be suitable for a site in Elise St. Rain that has cliffs. The explanation of a hydronym was mentioned early. In 1901 Camille Julien said that the name of Elise derived from the spring in the heart of the village and which was very famous until the early 20th century. It recurred in 1908 by breaking the radical asterisk Alice into two themes, Al pluses. In 1956 Paul Lebel did not resume this juxtaposition of the two hydronymic themes. He proposed instead for some rivers the prototype Asterisk Eliza from the post-Celtic period, which is why in the case of Elysia, he ultimately opted for the Oronym. In 1990 the study of the etymology of the name of Elysia was taken over by Marianne Mullen. She wrote that the Oronymic and the Hydronymic tracks were both reasonable proposals. The same year Ernest Negri in his General Toponymy of France, Volume 1, explained the name of Elise saint Rain as pre-Celtic asterisk Alice plus Gallic suffix Iowa and he indicated that it is a derivative from a designation of a spring. In 1995 the historian Francis Lassus and linguist Gerard Tavadet annotate the study by Ernest Negri stating that his explanation by hydronym is legitimate because of the thermal spring present at Elise. In 2007 Gerard Tavadet stated that this spring has been the subject of numerous pilgrimages while being exploited for therapy. In 2010 Stefan Gendron, another toponymist, posed the question, is it from the root asterisk ales designating a mountain or the root asterisk alice designating the spring? He adds, however, that the village has a mineral source in a sanctuary with a Gallic bathhouse with a therapeutic function. The Healing Waters site were undoubtedly famous since Celtic times. In the modern era the trade in mineral water from Elise went beyond the borders of Burgundy and even extended to Europe which lasted until the early 20th century. The sanctuary was very large and it was dedicated to Apollo Maritasgus. Jacques Lacroix said that this deity was associated with the healing waters with the first part of its name Mori designating the sea or water as in Amorica or in the maritime tribe of the Marini. During the revolutionary period of the National Convention, the commune bore the names of Elise and Petite Elise. History 
Elise is strongly reminiscent of Elysia and it is perhaps no coincidence since the town lies at the foot of Montauxois and the Galacopidum, attested by excavations and a likely archaeological site. Although still contested by some of the ancient fortress defended by Vercingetorix, Saint Rain is directly derived from the name of the Christian martyr Saint Rain who was beheaded at this place in 252 AD, and who is the commune's patron saint. The common symbol to represent the town is the statue of Vercingetorix erected by the orders of Napoleon III to show the strength of Gaul. The identification of Elysia with Elise The identification of Elysia with Elise is based on a now considerable amount of archaeological and historical research. Elise is the oldest site identified with Elysia. The identification had already been made in the Carolingian period. There is no real inconsistency between Caesar's text and the site as long as it is understood that, in the first place, Caesar was addressing a Roman public who were a little anxious about topographical information for a site they would never see in. In the second place, that Caesar was writing a story destined to be valued according to be a number of rules in rhetorical commonplaces. The text of Dion Cassius placing Elysia in Saquanes was written long after the siege and may be wrong. Its value as a source cannot be placed above the text of Caesar or the text of Strabo, which placed Elysia closer to Arvanus. Although the remarks of Diodorus of Sicily on Elysia are not as late as Dion, their value should not be exaggerated and cannot fully guide a search. Didorus was concerned not only with the location of the site but also with its religious character. The Oppidum on Mount Auxois at Elise first revealed Gallo-Roman constructions from after the battle, but its Gallic levels are now known to be contemporary with the Gallic Wars and have been so identified without any doubt. A Gallic inscription in Latin characters from the Roman era is assuredly the name of the place. Alasir, an identification of the Gallic form of the name with the Latin form Elysia, is explained by the phonology of the short vowels e and i in Gallic. Excavations in the reign of Napoleon III identified clear traces of Roman siege works. Long criticized, their value has been confirmed by excavations in the 1990s by a Franco-German team. The Roman temporary fortifications that were found it consistent with Caesar's text, even if they show that Caesar sometimes generalized his descriptions. Excavations demonstrated the ability of the Romans to adapt their equipment to the terrain. Coins found in the 19th century were authenticated by recent scientific studies including those of Jean-Baptiste Colbert de Bullion New. Discoveries made in the 1990s. The large number of Roman coins is easily explained by the presence of Caesar's legions. The great diversity of Gallic coins with significant Arvernian sets including coins of Versinghatorix, the Aedui and the Sequana, can only be explained by the presence of coalition troops. The discovery, during recent excavations in one of the Roman camps, of a sling shot with the name of Caesar's Lieutenant Labianus leaves no possible doubt that the fortification works are from Caesar's army and date from the Gallic War. The series of archaeological aerial photographs taken since 1959 show evidence of continuous lines of ditches corresponding to the military investments of the Siege of Elysia. Given these facts, a consensus on the location of the battle has been reached by professional historians and archaeologists in France and abroad. However, associations and individuals continue to put forward alternative hypotheses. Administration List of successive mayors demography In 2009 the commune had 624 inhabitants. The evolution of the number of inhabitants is known through the population censuses conducted in the commune since 1793. From the 21st century, a census of communes with fewer than 10,000 inhabitants is held every five years. Unlike larger towns that have a sample survey every year, population change sources LDH, -E -H -E -S -S, Cassini until 1962, INSE database from 1968, Culture and Heritage, 
Civil heritage The commune has a number of sites that are registered as historical monuments. The Versinger Thorax Monument was commissioned by Emperor Napoleon III from the sculptor Amy Acute Millet and installed in 1865 on Montauxois. Picture Gallery of the Versinger Thorax Monument the St. Rain Hospital. The hospital contains a very large number of items which are registered as historical objects. For a complete list including links to descriptions click here and here. The ancient site of Elysia. The Museo Park a Leisure has an oppidum and the remains of a Gallo-Roman city. On 26 March 2012 the Interpretation Center was open to the public and aims to attract 150,000 visitors a year. The Gallo-Roman site The archaeological site of Elysia was not abandoned following the siege of Elysia. Recent excavations have unearthed the ruins of buildings that reflect the Romanization of the site. There is a theatre to the northwest, which was a feature of Roman Gaul. It has a caviar in the shape of a semicircle, in which the audience sat on wooden bleachers that have disappeared over time. The actors appeared in the orchestra. The capacity of the theatre is estimated to have been 5,000 seats, which is low compared to the theatre at Autun. The circular wall of the caviar measures 81 metres. To the east of the theatre stood a temple which was commonly used in Gallo-Roman cities for both religion and entertainment. The cellar of this temple stood on a podium similar to the Maison Carry in Nîmes. Modest in size, it was opened up in accordance with the requirements of worship. Its façade had four columns of which nothing remains today. Archaeologists believe that this temple, which is surrounded by a wall built in the 2nd century AD, was dedicated to Taranus or Jupiter. The objects found at the site and kept at the Elysia Museum reflect the emergence of the cult of Cybel in the 3rd and 4th centuries. Next to the temple a basilica served the political and judicial functions of the city. The curia and courts held meetings in this type of building. The affairs of the city were also discussed in the public square, the Forum. It was lined with shops and served as a meeting place for the city's inhabitants. There is a monument to the north of the Forum that is said to be of Acuatus, headquarters of the Corporation of Bronze Ears. It also served as a shrine to honor the gods Bergugia and Acuatus. Picture Gallery of the Museo Park A Leisure View of the Fortifications Archaeodroma Talese Saint Rain Gallo-Roman Divinities Silver Drinking Cup 1st Century The Cellar of a House Map of Fortifications Built for Caesar at Elysia Monument of Acuetus Ovens for Bronzing Religious Heritage The Commune has several religious sites that are registered as historical monuments. The Koipirwa Stone Cross, a stone cross and altar at its base. The Chapel and Fountain of St. Rain. The chapel contains a very large number of items which are registered as historical objects. For a complete list including links to descriptions click here. Other religious sites of interest The Church of St. Ledger partly dates from as early as the 7th century. The Church Exterior, the Bell Tower, the Church Interior, a temple at Quoi St. Charles, has remains of columns, an octagonal sanctuary with its annexes and trenches indicating a surrounding wall, and unidentified quadrangular buildings, cultural events. Every Saturday and Sunday in August is a representation of the Mystery of St. Rain, a tradition that dates back to 866. The Festival of Newt's Peplum de Lazia, a contemporary music festival in late July. Notable people linked to the commune. Saint Rain, Christian Martyr, Felix Gaia, a French Catholic priest, resistance fighter and politician was born in Elise Saint Rain on the 22nd of January 1876.